my goodness me. Is that right? Yeah. <laughs> my, is that right? Yeah, I'm here. <laughs> I'm so excited to be back in Glastonbury. This is a flying visit, literally, in today, out tomorrow. Um, and uh, yeah, I know I said I wasn't going to do a live today because I was going to have my hands operated on, but they cancelled it due to the strikes. So blessings to all those who are striking. And double blessings to all those who have had their operations cancelled because it's devastating. It's going to take a good six months to do the other hand and uh, it, um, as a master healer, it's really frustrating that I can't heal it myself. So I've been given another three months to have a really good go. So here we are at Bridget's Bell and uh, ready for the 11.11. Now, if you've never seen Bridget's Bell here at the base of the of the tour i'm just going to throw a stone at it and make a wish for you okay ready steady <laughs> oh gosh i hope you got that wish as well so here we are and we're going to bring in the angels and i'm just going to turn around gently so that we get the view of the tour behind us so that you can really experience the Glastonbury tour today as we bring in the Angels of Awakening and uh, how is that? Um, Ria's here, it's so lovely to see Ria after such a while. There we are. Cool. So take a big deep breath. Oh this Somerset air is just phenomenal. I'm really so excited to be back here. So take that beautiful breath as we are going to call in the angels. I think I'm a bit early today. I think it's uh, we got here with such excitement that uh, Ria and I have just set up really early. So I'm going to give you a few minutes to get yourself ready, uh, be comfortable. If you've got any crystals, then hold your crystals. Um, all mine are, uh, <laughs> I've left them behind. There's them in my handbag over there, but we won't worry about it now. Um, I'm just going to hold the crystal that I'm always wearing, the crystal cave, and as we call in your angels. So take a big deep breath. <sighs> Calling in your guides. Calling in your guardian angels, the archangels that are working with you. Call all of the beings of light. And as you call them in now, especially Tor Hannah, the Archangel of the Tor, she's the most beautiful being, um, and uh, the energy of Tor Hannah is one of love. I'm just going to ask Rhea, can you see the Tor behind me? Wonderful, good. I'll stop moving around then. <laughs> so fantastic. So. I am so excited to be here and bubbling with energy. It's just flowing through my feet. And that's what you do when you go to a new place. You make sure that you are anchored and earthed, really connected to the earth by dropping your anchor, dropping from your root chakra. Um, and in Glastonbury, the energy of this is like a big crystal. So you have to literally corkscrew your energy through your root chakra. So if we're all ready now, we're going to begin. Oh, take that breath. The breath of life. Calling in your angels to bring the energy from the stars and the planets, the angelic spheres through from the top of the tour through to the earth right through this whole area is radiating we are in the inner circle of the tour the energy field so breathing in that light breathing in that love breathing in that energy and as you breathe it in just feel it oh, really filling your lungs with this light with this love as it fills your tank of love your tank of love just filling from the tip of your toes to the tip of your fingertips right up to the top of your head. And as you close your eyes, coming out of your head, giving yourself the most beautiful, biggest smile in the world. Oh, my smile is there today. It's so instant. And feel that smile and swallow that smile into your heart as your heart smiles back. 
And as the smile just flows through every cell, every atom, every electron of your being, as it just fills the space of your body. And as this smile just feels, brings the joy, the joy of being wherever you are and uh, wherever you are, appreciate where you are, standing strong, standing tall. And as you, your smile brings this love, this joy into your heart, feel your heart opening at this space of the pearl, of the, of the, of the heart chakra, re really breathing in, opening your heart. And as you breathe, and as the light and the heart opens, the petals of your heart, see your heart chakra as a flower, as the petals open one by one by one until all 12 petals are firm and bright, radiant in light, radiant in love. And as these petals are firm and bright, shining it out through your physical body, your mental body, your emotional body, your karmic body, your spiritual body, all your bodies radiating in this light, in this love. And as it flows through your whole body in the center, step into the center of the heart chakra, stepping into this golden flame of love, where you're stepping into your infinity of love, into your pearl of your heart, the pearl of your being. And as you step into this place and source of your love, just feel that love. Oh my goodness me, absolutely. Oh, my whole body is just tingling with being joy, being back here in Glastonbury. Um, so uh, it's ju just fabulous. I do hope you're feeling the energy of the tour. It's pretty awesome, isn't it? Just beautiful. Um, and so uh, as this energy flows through the golden light, through the pearl of your heart, through this, this wonderful multicolored rainbow light that is the pearlescent light of your tour, of the energy of your of your heart as it fills your body <laughs> and in this space and place of love call in that which is yours by divine right that which is yours by divine order we're getting ready now for the spring equinox for astara and i'm really excited about it and we, what was your wish for uh, Bridget's bell. Um, I know what my wish was, and uh, uh, so bring more energy into that wish. Wish for you, for your family, um, for your uh, for Easter, for the new beginnings of fertility, because that's what's coming up now in the next uh, week or so. Um, I think it's two weeks. Oh, is it? No, it's a month. Gosh, it's a whole month. Um, but the energy of the spring equinox is next week, isn't it? So that's the goddess Istra um, ready for the uh, the energy of the spring equinox. So in that space, in the pearl of your heart, sing. Sing and allow the energy to sing your heart, singing with the joy of the spring, the joy of being here at Glast in Glastonbury, Glastonbury Tour, uh, Bridget's at Bridget's Bell, and with the uh, energy of the heart chakra now absolutely radiating through your body. Can you feel your tingles? Can you feel the the flow of energy now from the top of your head, from your crown, flowing right through from your third eye, your throat, through to your heart, your heart opening with this love, with this light, through to your solar plexus, your sacral chakra, your trust center, trusting that everything will be okay, will be good as you ro root and anchor and really feel that energy of safety and security all the way down into the base of your heart of Mother Earth, right down to your root chakra. And so as um, the energy flows, I must say I'm absolutely freezing standing here. It is so cold. 
<laughs> Just going to make sure my nose isn't running. There we go. Um, what we do for love, what we do for joy, for uh, expression, um, and uh, really, oh, here we go. We've got some two lovely little dogs come in as well. Oh, there's three. That's lovely. So life arising all around and what we do for love, what we do to bring us joy, what we do to really bring in the angels and thank the angels for uh, for that joy, for that love, for the opportunity of being able to come to Glastonbury uh, at a whim, um, uh, making the best of a bad day. It was, uh, I've waited over a year to have this operation on my hand, so obviously the angels are trying to tell me something, aren't they? Go to Glastonbury, don't have the operation. <laughs> Unfortunately, the pain's so high, but uh, yeah, just have to keep keep healing it. That's what we do. And if you have um, uh, uh, any issues with your hands, um, blessings and commiserations to you. Um, uh, it's about not being able to handle life. It's or it's hanging on to too much, hanging on to things that you really need to let go of. And uh, um, uh, when you start to let go, uh, uh, that then. Uh, obviously your body starts to react in a different way so I hope you've enjoyed this fleeting visit this extra impromptu 1111 I really wasn't expecting to be here last week when we talked about uh, um, what was going to happen um, so you never know what's going to happen live for the moment be in the now the new now um, and live every moment as if it is filled with joy and my goodness me look at that joy look at that absolute incredible sight there the tour and the orchard and uh, Bridget's Bell all here and of course I've just realized these two beautiful trees that are either side of Bridget's Bell they are the, the uh, guardians and uh, lots of ribbons on them um, today. So as spring is starting to happen now, um, really put that spring into your step. Perk up your petals. Perk up your petals and really, and really enjoy life because life and love is all there is. Love is all there is. Everything else is fear. I could be sitting at home now, really grumbling and and getting very cross with with life because it wasn't going my way, or getting in the car and saying, <laughs> "I'm not going to swear." <laughs> if you know me well, you know I would have sworn then. <laughs> And get out there and go for it, girl, as my mum would say. Put a smile on your face, a wiggle in your ass, and off you go, girl. And that's what we're doing. So I hope you've enjoyed the uh, mes me meditation today. And I hope that uh, you are making the best of uh, a, a bad situation if you're in one, or making the joy and love if you're in a good one and it is what you make it so make it a good one hopefully i will see you next week um uh, in back in london but you never know <laughs> so from my heart to yours with a big beautiful big angelic etheric hug thank you for watching if you want any information go to my website it's daisyfoss.com and uh, look out for me on uk health radio i've just started a radio show i know i was going to keep that secret but it's just come out um <laughs> starting next week so ukradio.com absolutely beautiful space Mwah, lots of love <laughs>